Eric Reed, we're sitting at your farm here in Lexington. We're not far from where you endured the low point in your career, and now you've reached the high point. How far away are we from where that barn fire was five and a half years ago? Maybe 150 yards. Okay, which way? Right out there where right that new that barn way. is sitting. That would have been half of the old barn, and it was twice as big and long, so it went all the way down the row of trees down there, and half of it's gonna stay hollow ground. Nothing's gonna ever be built on it. It's there to remember what was there. Mm. We got a new barn that can't even get close to taking its place, but that's that's where we are. And where then in relation to that would we find Rich Strike? Rich Strike is in barn one, which is the concrete barn right adjacent mm -hmm. from the lake. Okay. He's, if you go through the middle of the barn, he's the first stall on the floor. Tell me about his personality around the barn. I know it's very different than what we might have some, seen what uh, happened with the uh, pony after the Kentucky Derby, but he's quite a very different horse normally, right? Yeah, he's a real fun fun to be around horse. He loves attention. He eats baby carrots all day from people and some peppermints, and he doesn't have a mean bone in his body. He's a, he's a colt, so he'll nip and play with you if you put your hands out there, but he's not ever trying to really hurt anybody, and he's he loves attention. Can you win the Triple Crown? He can if it's uh, if, if the two-week turnaround back to the three-week turnaround is doable, I, I know he can. The Preakness is going to be real hard for him to do. It just goes against everything that he needs to run. But he's getting better and better. And um, if he can get better off the Derby, they're going to have a real hard time. Could be the toughest of the three then because the Derby set up for him in terms of the pace being out in front of him. The Belmont sets up for him for distance, but the Preakness may not have any of those things. No, it's shorter distance, tighter turns, a speed favoring track. Um, yeah, he's got his work cut out for him when he gets to, to, to the Preakness, but he had his work cut out for him the Derby from the 20 hole too. You loving the dream? You living the dream? You enjoying the dream? I love it every minute of it. Everybody says you deserve it, and I don't know if I deserve anything, but I'm sure going to enjoy it. Thank you, Eric. Thank you. I appreciate this.